What is a certificate revocation list? In this video, we will try to understand that in detail. In encrypted communication like TLS, public key encryption is used to authenticate the server and the client. Later, the actual data is encrypted using symmetric key encryption and transmitted. At the start of the communication, the server sends this digital certificate to the client. The digital certificate contains the public key of the server. The client needs to ensure that the same public key certificate is indeed the certificate of the server. In order to do so, the client needs to verify the digital certificate with the issuing certificate authority. Now, when a certificate authority issues a digital certificate to an entity, the digital certificate contains various information such as a serial number, an expiration date, public key of the entity, digital signature of the issuing certificate authority, etc. The digital certificate expires after the expiration date. But let's say the private key corresponding to the public key in a digital certificate is compromised or the certificate authority was compromised. In that case, the owner of the digital certificate needs to revoke the digital certificate so that attackers cannot exploit the secret keys anymore. A certificate revocation list is a list of digital certificates that have been revoked by the issuing certificate authority before the expiration date of the certificates. If a digital certificate is in the certificate revocation list, then it indicates that the digital certificate can no longer be trusted. A certificate revocation list is periodically published by a certificate revocation list issuer. The certificate revocation list issuer can be the issuing CA that issues the digital certificate or it can be some other trusted authority. There are two types of certificate revocation lists, base CRL and delta CRL. A base CRL contains a list of all revoked digital certificates that are not expired and a delta CRL contains a list of digital certificates that are revoked after the last base CRL was published. To know whether a digital certificate is revoked, an entity needs to download both the base CRL and the delta CRL and check whether the digital certificate is present in the base CRL or the delta CRL. If the digital certificate is present in any of the CRLs, the entity will know that the digital certificate is revoked and cannot be trusted anymore. I hope this helps. Interested viewers who want to know more, please refer to the book Cryptography and Public Key Infrastructure or visit the website of the security body. The relevant links are provided in the description. The security body also provides many cyber security courses. The relevant links are provided in the description. You can also subscribe to us and get notifications on recent videos.